Hey everyone, I'm super excited to share this unboxing with y'all today. I am going to be unboxing the Harvest Market collection from Simple Stories and I hope to um, um, make this video live just before I do a process video using this collection so you can see everything that comes in it and then you can see a process video right after. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and quickly get started showing you the papers and then we'll show the embellishments. So here is this the, um, the cover sheet that comes in the 12 by 12 collection kit. So here are all the papers. Um, this one is Market Day, super gorgeous. I love it. Um, this is the B side, so lots of um, like advertisements kind of looks like, a, um, what am I trying to say? Like the little stickers that, you know, go on like product. Um, I love this collection. I love the pinks and then this really pretty, pretty like eggplant color. I think it's just gorgeous. And then of course the teal and the mints, um, along with the oranges. Very, very pretty. This one is called Hello Autumn and this would be so much fun to cut up. And then here's the B-side, just tone on tone plaid. Here is rake, pile, and jump, so just a ton of leaves. And then here is the B-side, which is a nice wood grain. Here are, or here is nuts about fall, so just a bunch of acorns um, with some fun patterns for the top. And then here is the B-side, really gorgeous. This one is called Pumpkin Days. And then here's the B-side. This one is called um, Farm Fresh, so it's just a bunch of jars, and it's so cute. I like this one. This one's fun. Um, and then here's the B-side. This one is Harvest Season with a bunch of pumpkins on top of, like, a notebook paper. Here are the tags paper, or here is the tags paper. Yeah. Really cute. Oh, I love these. Uh, prints and this is my first time going through it. I always like to film a process video with my, my first reaction um, And not looking through everything. So uh, yeah, these this collection is so super cute and as much as I love summer um, And I'm sad to see it go uh, You know going into fall and winter is going to also be fun um, So this is a great way to kick fall off. So here is a, the journal elements paper and then the B-side with a bunch of pumpkins, like you're looking at them um, from like up top. This one is the three by four elements paper. So lots of fun cut aparts. And you can cut these up, you can fussy cut the jar and this fun scale, really cute. And I like this side, this one's the B-side. And then here uh, is that print again, just in larger form. And this is the four by four um, elements paper. Oh, this one's gorgeous. Oh, I love that. So pretty. And then lastly, here is the four by six elements paper and then the B side. So really pretty. And I'll just leave these here just so you can not have that glare from my lights. Here uh, is the 12 by 12 cardstock sticker sheet. Really fun. So some titles and then the banner. I love that bluebird. So cute. Some jars. Just really, really cute. There's a barn and a chicken. I love it. And then you get your great phrases and then like a scalloped border sticker. Here are the bits and pieces. So here's everything that comes in the ephemera pack, or I'm sorry, the bits and pieces pack. Really fun. So you get like a title and then a sweater, a barn, this really cute market stand, an umbrella, <clears throat> excuse me, and some rain boots. I love that scarecrow. That's really cute. And that fall title, I, I'm probably going to use that for a title. Really, really cute. Here are the enamel dots. And um, let's see. Here are the journal bits. There's 41 pieces in here. So you get lots of great, I love the journal bits packs. I think they're great. Um, they're great for journaling. They're great for tucking. They're great for layering. I love these jars, or yeah, these jars and that cute acorn, some labels. Uh, these are awesome. I can't wait to tuck those in. Uh, really, really cute. God, there's so many. And then here is the sticker book. I should have opened it, sorry. And the sticker book has so many possibilities. Um, you know, obviously great for embellishment clusters and, you know, like I said, tucking and layering, but there's just so much more. Like, and you can back these with um, cardstock or a piece of paper and create your own embellishments with those. You get alphas. I love these circular elements. They're great to pop up on foam tape and put tangled thread behind. Um, you get more alphas. These are great for subtitles, adding dates. Oh, 
Look at, we get these as stickers too. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Oh, that's great. These acorns are adorable. Oh, I have so many, like just seeing these, like I want to pop them up and I want to like have them cascading down my page. They're so cute. Um, as the labels, one of my favorite things and these little tabs. There's more little icons. You can even build like a scene. That would be really cute. Then uh, the phrase stickers and some larger phrases. And then some really cute pumpkins and then some floral pieces. This is a great sticker book. There are a ton of different things in here. Oh my goodness, I love it. So 871 stickers, that is awesome. Here are the decorative brads. These are perfect for adding just that other extra element of texture for that metal. There's a chipboard stickers as well. They don't have the prongs behind them, so they're super easy to use. Here are the page pieces. Now these are, um, this set is great because if, uh, you want, are you traveling or going to a crop? Um, maybe you just want to create something real quick. Uh, you could just grab this entire pack and you can make like two separate layouts. It's awesome. <laughs> One of my favorite things are the chipboard frames. Um, these are fantastic. These are the ones that you get. So you get a round one or a circle one, and then you get a couple double frame ones and then um, some larger ones. So you can layer them up, you can put your photo behind them, you can make shakers, you can make an album with them. I've used that, I've used those to create a mini album and they're just so cute. Look at, the, oh, look at that little stand, it's so cute. Uh, here are, or here is the six by eight paper pad. Um, you basically get the same, I think you get the same patterns as you do in the 12 by 12. But then I believe there are a few different, like you actually, you get like different, um, like you get this, like little, these would be good for um, memory planning or like a, like a, what is the word I'm looking for? Um, a cup, not a cover page, a dashboard <laughs> for your planners. Um, so yeah, so you get those little cover pages. And I think um, everything else is pretty much the same, except you do get a few different, like that is, you know, like a bigger, the bigger icon um, and then you get like a larger a title page favorite color autumn so yeah oh and this one that one's really pretty pretty fall vibes so i love it just on a smaller pattern i love a six by eight paper pad i'm really excited for this stencil this one is called falling leaves really really pretty and then we have the foam stickers so lots of great fall titles there is that full um, element that I liked in the, uh, the, I think it was the journal bits or the ephemera bits and pieces. Um, so I like seeing it on our larger scale. So here's the other side. So fun. And then lastly are the chipboard stickers. And I love chipboard. I think it's so fun. I love that acorn. Really, really cute. So yes, that is the Harvest Market uh, collection. So stay tuned for a process video from me. Uh, but thanks so much for watching, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.